welcome back, this is Balluscuba with an episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. As you can see, I am in the, ver the middle of a very important battle with Lavos. Let's try to kill him! <laughs> this is actually the first time that you can take on Lavos, and I think that's going to be enough to kill Vash here. Now, I didn't actually try to win this fight, just for the record. That was, yeah, that was not a full attempt to beat Lavos, but there is a good reason to lose. Why is that? It's because of this alternate ending. They've actually programmed in an ending in which you die. How awesome is that? Who thinks of that? Nobody thinks of that. I mean, usually it's just a little game over cutscene or maybe a little explanation of what happens. They've programmed in a full cutscene. Direct attack on truce. No, not on truce. Calm down. How does it look down there? Looks bad. Doesn't look good. Looks like he's destroying the world. Wow. That looks a lot like Xenogears, to be honest with you. <laughs> you can see some, a lot of the influences uh, that Chrono Trigger... Whoa, that is not good. A lot of the influences that Chrono Trigger put onto Xenogears, you can see it in this game. Poor Chorus, Medina, everything's been destroyed! Director, we're under attack! Take over in the Shelter Dome! I don't remember a Shelter Dome. Director, sir, you must come with us! We're out of time, get moving! Now, like I said, well, this is an alternate ending. There are many alternate endings. This is just going to be the first one because once I get to the other stuff, it'll be a lot harder to let Lavos kill me. It'll take a lot longer. So while it's still, you know, reasonable for him to be able to kill me, we might as well show this one off. I, I was thinking about saving it for last, but thought better of it. And the day of destruction happens because... The future refused to change. And that's the game! And now we get the intro cutscene again. Yeah, that's pretty... That's, that's it. That's the, that's the alternate ending. Stay tuned. We've got many, many more to do. And now we're ready for the next ending! So, it is going to be Novin, Jojo, and Kyra. We are up against Lavos here. We should be very close to finishing them off. In order to get this ending, you need to use the bucket at the end of time after you have lost Vash and before you have gotten him back. Make sense? Makes sense. And by doing this, you get an alternate ending. Now, I should mention one thing. Uh, because I didn't fully go over this last time. With New Game Plus, you do need a save game to load all the data from. So, whatever you have on the last save game, that is what's going to forward for you. So, if you haven't saved in a long time, uh, you might want to do that before you beat Lavos. Just, you know, the save right beforehand will work great for that. Uh, Unfortunately, I apparently did it wrong. I used the wrong save for my file. And uh, I lost one of Luke's techs, unfortunately. Went back and got him. I was planning on using him for this part, but as you can see, I definitely got him back. We're at the end of time, though. I wonder what's going on. So here is Luke. Unfortunately, he wasn't in the fight with us because, well, he was very underleveled. He was about... 15 levels lower than everybody else because of all the the grinding that I've been doing. I can't seem to talk to anybody here. So, Lavos is gone, so the gate will shut. Return now. You'll be lost in time. No. Everybody, oh, everybody woke up at the same time. Let's go back in time and save Vash. This really is the last we will see of each other. No, nobody wants to come with me? Don't you care? Tis necessary I return and protect Queen Lean. No, nobody wants, nobody wants to save Vash. Come on, Kino, wait for me. What kind of bullshit excuse is that? Luke, Luke, you're my only hope. No, he he refused to do it. 
Gaspar! Gaspar won't talk to me! Speccio! No, Speccio won't do anything either! You guys are just gonna leave him? What, what about Vash? We haven't gotten Vash yet! Jojo, go home now! Good luck, all! No, the gates are closing! Fare thee well! No, then! Bloom, don't do it! Goodbye, everyone. You're all so heartless. It's a fate we can't escape. Someday we will all pass away. Lamia. And off they fly as well. Hey there! They've all... Have they all left? I forgot to give them this. Oh well. The Chrono Trigger! We didn't get the Chrono Trigger! <sighs> and it's back to Lean Square for our party and our parade. H hooray. Come on, it's the last night of the fair. Princess Nadia is finally home at last. Guardia is back to normal. And it's a Moonlight Parade! H hooray. We didn't say Vash! He was important! He was important, damn it! Why? And, uh, I don't care, Titty! There's now is not the time, you know. Your master is not here. They still call him masters when it's a cat, right? I know it is for a dog, but cats are kind of independent. <laughs> so I don't know if the term really applies, but still, Vash isn't here, Kitty. You should be very upset. Eh, yeah, cats don't care. They, they hardly recognize that you give them food sometimes. At least the cats that I've met. I've never had a cat, to be honest with you. I've had a few dogs. But no cats. Hooray. We, we completed our parade. This is kind of set. What's with the black spot right there? Are all of them like that? They are! They're like over. Whatever. Yay! Happy girls out of nowhere. It's not nearly as creepy without Vasher. Yes, thank you. Yum. Lemonade sure tastes great outdoors. <laughs> oh my god, that's such a clear reference to alcohol. Uh, not much business with Yeah, he likes it that way. Anybody else here? Hey, it's uh, Vash's mom. <laughs> Have you seen Vash? He was really looking forward to this fair. Where do you suppose he is? <laughs> I lost him. <laughs> it's a real problem when the person who's in charge of the cat is gone. <laughs> I told you, the cat. So I guess Master stole the term for cat. Still, it doesn't sound right. Cats have no masters. Garho, where are you going? I don't think I didn't see you. I, I, I still can't go... Yeah, I still can't go over there, but... You know, always worth checking. You never know with this kind of stuff. Yeah, everything is blocked off, so let's just head straight up here. I don't want to miss anything! I thought Lavos made the gates. But I guess I was wrong. What do you mean? I think a greater force wanted us to experience those events. Time travel. How exhausting. We should dismantle the epoch. It, its job is finished. What? No. Why? Why would we dismantle the epoch? <laughs> its job is clearly not finished. We have to go back in time and save Vash. What part of that don't you understand? Yeah, everyone else is fine. Oh, they all popped out of the gate at once. What happened to four more people going to the end of the time? Your rules game. You made up these rules. I I accepted your rules. Give me time egg. Calm down. Russian won't bring him back. Okay, understand. Now hurry, give! Hey, he is escaping! O okay, that was kind of glitchy. What's going on? Novin, since he's the only person left? That time egg of his can bring him back. Bring who back? Him who shall not be named? Yes. What the hell was that? That was all glitchy. Let's catch up with them! Go after them, but the gates? Kyra, don't turn off your brain yet! 
I forgot we have a time machine. <laughs> That's the sound that you make when you have something. Oh, princess, the king asks for your presence. But, but, but I have to get Vash. Like, couldn't we just do this thing? I stand, you know, Lamia stands here with her pendant. You flick that and it creates the gate. Can't we just do that thing again? You know, we gotta talk to the king. I guess it's time travel. There's no, there's no rush on time. Did I just run right by the king? I think I did. I did. What's up, kingy? I'm so happy. Now there's no reason for you to go away anymore. Except there is. I have a gift for you to commemorate this day, Princess Nadia. Of course, what do you have for me today? Surprise, surprise, it's a bell. Like, I haven't seen this before. This is Nadia's bell. It will ring out across the land. Now you put it up by yourself. I'm busy. Lamia, where did you go? Could someone please lend me a hand? Daddy, I hate to say this, but... I can't sit around doing nothing. And then she laughs and runs off, leaving her dad high and dry. And off they fly in the epoch. I recognize that sound anywhere. Phew, made it just in time. Shall I fire one off? Uh, no, Taman. Actually, I could use a little help here. But off go the fireworks. And we get our second actual ending. This is one that, you know, actually goes to the credits. But once again, we're going to keep everything in. Because, as we've seen before, there is, you know, different stuff. Even after the credits start rolling. Which is kind of strange. Kind of strange, to be honest with you. You know, once you get to the credits, you would assume that would be the end of everything. Nobu Umatsu. The best video game composers I know of. But that's just me being a fanboy, probably. And off we fly in the epoch. What scenes will we see this time? Is it, is it really just going to be the same ones that we saw when the cats went through the gate? Because if you remember before, it was... You know, the first time it was them... Uh, Vash and Lamia flying through the air in their balloons. And then the second time, it was something similar to this. Now, I can't imagine that everything would be the same with this but if it is it is you know they only programmed two credits I can't say that I can blame them too much you know how many credits do you want them to program in Kobayashi he eats hot dogs and uh, he also made world maps maybe there's more than one Kobayashi that sounds unlikely though so what scenes are we going to see this time after we fly through the epoch? Uh, it is the same. I mean, really? I, I mean, I'm still going to keep this in because technically this is the full ending that we're showing in. But really the same? That is so disappointing. No, I guess that looks a little different there. Since we saved... Uh, since we saved Luke this time, we shouldn't have... Yeah, see, there we go. We got some new stuff here. Of course, uh, if you had killed Luke instead of bringing him in your party, you would have gotten the, uh, the Novan turning back into Glenn scene, I suppose. But, now we need, we need more Luke. Because this is probably going to be the last time that we see him, to be honest with you. Because all the other endings don't require me go that far in the game. <laughs> to the point where I get to Luke. So, we we'll probably won't see him again until uh, maybe the very end. I might do a special that I'm still thinking about. That uh, I've never actually seen anybody do it. So, I'm going to try. I don't know if it's real or if it's just a rumor. But I'm going to head for it, and we'll see either way. Hopefully there is something there. But then again, I've never actually looked to see if it was real or not. I've just heard it, and I've just never seen it. And I remember thinking to myself, that's insane when I first heard about it. But we will try. We will definitely try. And now we zoom out on the world, and we never know if they save Vash or not. 
Without my guidance, could they have figured this out all by themselves? Who knows? Who knows? Is that going to be the end? Are we going to move on to the regular credits? No, we got something else here. How you doing, Lamia? And now we're doing regular credits, so this is going to be the scene through the regular credits. I'm going to continue watching these, uh, make sure there's nothing else uh, different here. As long as there isn't anything else different, that is going to do it for this part of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I've been Bala Scuba. I've been joined, as always, by everybody except for Vash. He didn't make it. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. Oh, there is something here. Never mind. We're still going. Go get him! He's right there! Now I have to do another outro. Damn it. Those things take forever. Oh, and then we get the pictures. Oh, I mean, it's kind of hot. What the hell happened there? There we go. The end. Oh. And now we're on the uh, the other credits. Uh, these are these are standard because this, of course, is the PlayStation version. So that is going to do it for these parts. So once again, I hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. <laughs>